Well, a teenager is behind bars this morning after police say he set off a chain reaction crash that ended with a car inside of a corner store in Kensington. Honest reporter Jan Carabello is live at East Detectives with more on exactly what happened. Good morning, Jan. Rahel and Jim, good morning. Police say everyone is extremely fortunate that no one was seriously injured during this crash. This is a very busy area of Kensington, a lot of foot traffic, a lot of vehicular traffic alike. As for the 18 year old driver, he will likely face a number of charges. Police say he was driving a stolen vehicle at the time, and as you mentioned, at the end of the night, caused a four car crash and actually drove that vehicle into the front of a corner store there in Kensington. If you take a look at the video, you can see all of the damage and destruction this 18 year old driver left behind. Police say this crash happened right around 7:30 last night. According to witnesses, the SUV was speeding along the 3400 block of Frankfurt Avenue. As it got to the intersection of Frankfurt and Tioga Street, the driver smashed into an oncoming car head-on, causing a chain reaction crash. That car hit a third car, and then the SUV crashed into a parked car, jumped the curb, and then smashed into a corner store. There, police arrived quickly to the scene to witness the driver and passenger of that SUV climbing out of the vehicle. Both of them ran away, but they didn't get far. Police arrested the teenage driver about a block away. Now back at the scene, police ran the plates, and it turns out that SUV had been stolen in Philly the day before. Meantime, inside the corner store, two employees there were lucky. They weren't seriously injured. Take a listen. Inside the corner store, there were no customers. However, there were two female employees. There was a 19-year-old female who was pregnant at the time. A 20 year old female, both employees, they were shaken up. But they were not seriously injured. The occupants of the two other banged up cars were also taken to the hospital. No major injuries there. So everyone really fortunate after this crash. As for that 18 year old, again, he will face a number of charges, including leaving the scene of an accident and operating a stolen vehicle. The other person who was seen getting out of that stolen SUV is still on the loose this morning. Anyone with information should call police. But for now, we're live outside of East Detectives. Jan Carabello, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jim, more help. Back into you. All right, Jan, thank you.